This is for you to autograph. It says I've been an investigated and I'm happy the boiler's switched off and safe. It's ancient, isn't it? Should have just got it replaced when I got everything else done. Well, like I said, annual service would have been a start. So, what do you reckon the problem was then? Well, the problem was the flu. It was blocked. Well, how would that happen? I really couldn't tell you. Uh, but I've opened a ticket, so it'll be investigated. In the meantime, until your new one's installed, use the immersion heater for your hot water. Don't try switching it on. Don't worry, we won't, thanks. Yeah, cheers. You know, I've texted Rebecca to let her know her son's alive, and nothing, not a word. Not a thank God everyone's OK, or how the hell did that happen? Well, maybe she's not getting a text. Let's have a look at that. I'm going to get our stuff from the Dean being a bit. Hey. Well, look here. When did you turn into such a glass half full person? Paddy, the boiler's been off for two days. I know. We had a gas safety engineer out. I mean, there's a certificate if you don't believe us. I do believe you. <laughs> so what are you doing then? Right. I know it's safe. You know it's safe. Your mother... Oh. I promised her. She's just worried. And to be fair, it's pretty scary. You don't call it the silent killer for nothing. Hang on. Oh, what? Why do they call it the silent killer? <laughs> Funny, who cares? <laughs> it's colourless, it's odourless, it's tasteless. What's that got to do with being silent? What is he going on it's about? Just, when has any gas been noisy ever? <laughs> you have a word to know with Jimmy, then. <laughs> Did they say what was wrong with the old one? Yeah, the flu got blocked. What with? They didn't say. Well, was that normal? Does it happen? Did this time. I should have had it all checked out. Where did the building work live? Should have got a new boiler. Should have paid more attention when I put them batteries in that stupid alarm. Yeah, maybe. It's weird, though. Look at the state of that. Looks like you're trying to use chopsticks. It's not my fault my fingers don't get on together. <laughs> How's your head? Any better? Yeah, it still works, thanks. You can stop worrying now. But well, we're supposed to check you for this, isn't it? Turns out it's not actually that common. What isn't? Blocked flu. Listen, I feel bad enough about this as it is. Can we all just stop talking about it? Or you can stop assuming that it's your fault. Lachlan was in the flat. Definitely, I'm certain. Are you, you sure it wasn't just part of your dream? No. Well, yeah, I thought it was at first, but it's coming back to me now. I didn't dream that the batteries were the wrong way around in the alarm. Which is weird, unless Rob had some kind of senior moment while he was changing him. I don't think so, but it is possible. Oh, come on. I'm heading for a three in physics. Even Anna had to put batteries in. Are you saying Lachlan had something to do with this? He was here. I'm sure of it. All of a sudden, you're sure of it? Liv, come on, this isn't helping anyone. Well, neither's burying your head in the sand. We could have died, Aaron. How does the flu suddenly just get blocked? Oh, like I said, no one even listens to me anyway. Oh, she doesn't understand. She's got a hangover. I'm going out. She's right. It's understandable. Yeah, well, it is scary. I don't think it was easy for Liv to say any of that. Do you think it did have something to do with it? No, but she's right. The battery thing's weird. I can't explain that, can you? Or the flu. So maybe if she says she saw Lachlan here, then we should hear her out. No, I'll only encourage her. She'll calm down. Be with Gabby. She's obsessing, it's gonna end in trouble. You know what? The more you tell her to stop, the more she'll dig her heels in, because she's like you. That's a fair point. And don't forget that lad's capable of anything. Hurting Seb. Well, I've watched him up close. So what are you saying? Do you remember when she was inside? Do you remember what you promised each other? That you'd always be honest and talk. Well, that also means listening. <laughs> 